Hello everyone, I'm your host Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Sherlock Holmes the Devil's Daughter. I don't feel thirsty right now. I don't oh feel thirsty what? Right now. Damn it, and I was all hyped up. I gotta finish Oh wait. Wait, how do I Documents. Did I not Oh, I must have had it backwards. I probably now I probably have to Okay. Oh, this is the wrong building. Now I've got to go look in the attic, and then... Alright, so I guess it'll give me... Whoa, ho, 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 easy game. Man, this door sure is interesting. If only I'd open it. There we go. Well, some load time weirdness. Alright, let's look at this again. Oh, I guess I can look at this again. Maybe there's a clue upstairs. I didn't use clue of vision up here. No. Is there something I'm missing to this? Oh, nope, Tom, you've got nothing else to contribute to this conversation. No. Wait. No. Crash China? No. Wait, it made a sound. What is this doing? Because R1 is the... Hold on. Launch imagination. Oh, so maybe... Okay, hold on. So look at this. Look at this. The old Tabard pub, North Street. Glue. Probably taken from a wall. Oh, I needed to look at the glue. There we go. That's what I didn't do. The old Tabard pub? Did you hear anything about it from your father, Tom? My father's a regular... But he's not a drinker, sir. It's close by on North Street. Hey, I did it. Find out more information about the special job. Investigate this. Okay, so the investigate's just the global objective. Now I can go into the pub. Wait, I came in from this way. Oh, something's happening. Good day, Mr. Holmes. What are you doing here? Well, if it isn't young weekend, You're who I was thinking of. You found yourself a job. If you can call it that, I hate it. But if, if you've got any proper work for me, I just might be in need of your assistance later. Wait here. 
Higgins, that's who I was thinking of. I need to earwig to find out who is offering this special job. I don't know what that means. So it means just listen, correct? The child labor law sent your kids to school instead of the coal mine. So, okay, so I just gotta listen to these conversations. Oh, oh. That's a little disorienting. Ah, ah, I don't like this mechanic. It's weird. Equality for the working class. I'm glad I'm my own boss. I can complain only to myself. Or to Watson. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so... It's hurting my brain to do this, though. Ugh. Just have to keep an eye on which one is. The man who's offering that special job has a proper set of mutton chop whiskers. Hmm. Thank you for the information, boys. A proper set of mutton chop whiskers, eh? There's no one to eavesdrop on. Him. That's cool. I don't think that. I don't remember that being in the other one. Uh, mm. Uh, mm, uh. No, no, no. That fellow who's offering the special jobs, he never drinks alcohol. This is cool. I'm profiling him by listening so, to this. So, the man I'm looking for has whiskers and never drinks alcohol. I happen to be looking at him over there. Bit of a trouble with the chair. You're the man. Whiskers. Water. That's it? That's the observation? This must be the man that I'm looking for. Keep watch. Oh, interesting. I don't want to skip time. I might miss something. Oh, I can look around, kind of. Wow, he has eyes in the back of his head to be able to do this. Anyone want a special job? Okay, I'm careful. Oh, that was a gentleman over there. Another gentleman. Very. Oh, something's happening. Oh, I could have just done that. Interesting. Why did you rip that off the wall? Wow, you unfolded that perfectly. Interesting. A missing person. I should find out more. The third of October, Mr. John Stro Strowbridge went missing from Dorset Street under mysterious circumstances. If you have any information, please contact Mrs. Strowbridge at 5 Dorset Street. Thank you in advance for any... Oops. Information or help. Five Dorset, eh? Is this gonna be one of those things where, like, they're kidnapping all the poor and... Oh, I'm in pursuit. No, you're gonna be in pursuit. I need you to follow him and report back to me. All right, Mr. Holmes. Good man, Higgins. Oh, I'm playing as Higgins. This is new. Oh, I like this. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is.
What is this thing? It's just like Assassin's Creed. This is awesome. Chapel never changes. Dirt and feathers everywhere. I hope he doesn't go too far. This might have been a mistake. Oh, oh, oh. Larry Higgins, there's no time to lose. This is really cool. Oh, he's slowing down. No, he's just. Oh, there we go. I have a feeling I'm being watched. What? I don't. You know what? That was actually really offensive. I apologize. I'll wait to hear his accent before I make fun of it. Whoa! Supposed to like look at him? Oh, now is obs observation time. Oh, hello. They won't let me pass. I'll need to find another way. What do you mean they won't let you pass? Damn it, Higgins. Rich folk feed meat to their dogs. Living costs are too much these days. My son has to work down the sewers. There he is. You better be in this cover. There's a red... Okay, if I get too close, there's definitely a warning. It really is like Assassin's Creed, just less stabby. Okay, is he turning left or right? He's turning right. I'm around the corner. I'm in pursuit. Take a brush and get in there. Boys from the Bruisers gang. Better keep out of their way. Boys from the Bruisers gang? Stop crying and get to work. Conveniently, this is open. I'll be able to continue the chase if I climb up the chimney, but it's dangerous. The fuck? What are you waiting for? <laughs> Please, you don't have to beat him. I'll do it. I'll clean the chimney. Go on then. Am I on the roofs now? How can you climb a chimney like oh like this, I guess? Oh I see. I actually do have to clean the chimney. This is gross. Shouldn't they put out the fire when I'm cleaning the chimney? <coughs> that dude's gonna be long gone by the time I clear out of this thing. Well, it's nice to know that in pursuit of this criminal, I am slowly destroying this boy's lungs. <coughs> Probably get asthma if he's lucky. Uh oh, why was that red? I guess I was in danger. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim chimney. Chim chim he's still here. That's a relief. <laughs> that is a relief, given. Oh, what the fuck? Look at this door just going nowhere. What is this? Oh, that's what that is. Whoa. Okay, over this. <laughs> this is the most intense chase ever. Oh, oh. Oh, so I have to keep... Okay. This hurts my brain. All 
Alright. Thanks. This kid thinks this is better than selling papers? He's a crazy boy. You better be turning left. No, you're turning right. I'm fucked. Oh. He's gonna see me, isn't he? Down here. Interesting. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? Or lie in the morning. Or lie. Or lie. You're not cover. You're just boxes. I've been lied to. No place to hide here. We better go through the yard. Then I'll go through the yard. Oi, what are you doing in my garden? In my garden. Now I'm not in your garden. This is so weird. Oh. Cover. Where are you going, dude? It feels like we've gone in a big circle. Wow. That's the problem with these types of things. Same thing with the Assassin's Creed. No human being would turn around this... Stop. Literally stop in their tracks and turn around to check if someone's following them this many times. It just doesn't happen. Wait, where am I? I know that boy. He's shoe shine Jim from Chamber Street. He's mute because he's drunk slept by the beat. Hey Jim, can you lend me your kit? I'm on a secret mission for Mr. Holmes. Mm -hmm. That's sad. Mute because his father. Beats him. I think it's like dramatic spy music is still playing. This could be useful with a small brush. Don't be a piece of shit. Man, I hope I know if I'm shining a shoe correctly. This one? Ooh, very nice. No, put this back. Put this back. I can't... Oh, there we go. Now this one. Oh man, I kind of blew it because I didn't do that correctly. How would I know though? I don't know how to shine shoes. Hello, dogs. Not gonna deal with those pups. Oh, the weather's good. No, the way was breezy. Suspect lost. Where is he? Oh. I can't lose him now. I don't really need the sprint here. Uh, I've lost him. What do you mean you've lost him? I was right behind. Do I have to actually... Oh, maybe I have to get on the carriage. That's why it was prompting me to sprint when it was so slow. I can't lose him now. <laughs> oh. 
Okay. Interesting. Come on then. Which, yeah. Locked, huh? Oh, wait, was that a crack in the wall? No. So, we climb over. Aha! Uh -huh. Why am I in first per- oh, I'm not in first person. Do only two people live here? I wish one was me. Bags of food. I like this ass. Okay. The door is open. Did it close? Oh. Some magical force propelled it closed. Honestly, really? I can't see what's inside. I can't see what's inside. It's too dangerous to enter. Yeah, I was confused why there's even a prompt for it. Can I unlock this door from this side? Locked. No. Nope. Hmm. It sure didn't seem locked when that guy walked through him. Through it. Through them. to be in crouchy stealth mode. I can't see what's inside. Oh, some oh no, it's a ladder. I thought it was a an easel. It's too dangerous to enter. Whoa. Oh, a coat of arms. It might help Mr. Holmes. I'll make a drawing of it. <laughs> Good thing you had all the things necessary to make a drawing on you. Wow, a lot of expensive stuff. Time to report to Mr. Holmes. Let's get outside before I get caught. See, that phrasing makes me think he's going to get caught. But I've been wrong before. Someone should fix this wall. It's the perfect height for rapscallions to climb over. Boo boo boo. It takes a little while to load. I haven't actually had a deduction space yet. Hmm. You can find gameplay in if wait, what was that? If I press L three and R three? I probably have a cutscene now, so I won't be able to test that. Wiggins' tale was quite unusual. What do you make of what he found, Holmes? That's a good drawing. Oh, neat. That's really handy actually. Wiggins did a good job. Okay. Are we not going to look at the thing? Well, it's got two lines. There's a flower up top. Two do no, three doves. Two facing to the right. Or to the left. And three crosses. I once... Someone showed me there's like a way to logic out how... Coat of, coats of arms are designed. Holmes, we need to help poor Tom. Holmes. Oh right, we now I need to go to the Tom. database. Coat of arms. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Okay, coat of arms. Put 
between marks and symbols. Royal potato cans. That's not the one I need. English coat of arms. Coat of arms of the Marsh family. Oh, that's what I'm looking at. Nowadays, the representative of this family is Lord Edward Marsh, the well-known benefactor. He provides the poor people of Whitechapel with provisions, warm clothes, etc. Lord Marsh is also renowned as a co-founder of the special education program, which allows poor people the opportunity of an education. Here it is. Oh, that was fast and easy. I got that immediately. This man could be Lord Marsh. Huh. A lord who hangs around in a public house. Let's pay a visit to Lord Marsh. We'll pretend that we're interested in his charitable activities. Whatever you say, Holmes. Mr. Holmes, you have a visitor. Oh, just ask him to wait. I'm afraid that won't be possible. This young lady refuses to wait for anything. What? Father! Caitlin! <laughs> Miss Caitlin's boarding school was flooded. Everyone was sent home. As if it could smell any mustier. <laughs> I did not know My word, how is it possible that you have grown up so fast? You'll be staying. Wherever will we put you? Holmes, I'll give her my room, of course. What do you have to say, Kate? You're on a new case. A respectable lady who's being blackmailed? Or is it a love story between a prince and a suffragist? However did you guess? <laughs> you will tell me, won't you, Father? But you'll make Watson jealous. All right, then. Have fun. I'll go and unpack. Will you help me, Mrs. Hudson? She has flowers in her hair. How pretty. It's wonderful to have Kate home. Oh, wow. Then there's immediately a reef on the door. All right, neat. It's Kate. Ooh, swords. All right, this is cool so far. I like the new mechanic with Wiggins, but I'll continue this in the next episode. So thanks for joining me. Come back up the next step up real soon, but until then, bye.